So we're on the set of uh, Woman in the Chair. We're doing set design and we were challenged with um, how to age a wall without affecting the wall itself. So uh, this is for the intention of uh, pretending that the paint on the wall is, is just peeled off like this and you can see like the wood or whatever's underneath uh, or insulation that's underneath. So just take really cheap, this is like 100 yen. Rip it off in a way that uh, you want. Okay, now I got um, color pastels. Uh, you can get them from, uh, uh, well, we're in Japan, so you can get this for 100 yen, um, a whole thing of pastels. Now you can use black, I'm using purple, and it's actually working really well, just using purple. So uh, this is really easy. So you just start doing this. Try to do it in a straight line to simulate a wood pattern. This corner that you tore looking dark, which it naturally, naturally becomes dark. Leaving it like this is totally fine, but I want to add a little bit of detail. I want to, I want to make it like a, a wood. So let's say I want like a wood piece. So I do this. Okay. Uh, make it a little bit more shaded here. Again, this is optional if you want it to look like a oops, it look like wood piece. Now I'm thinking I want to put like a, a knot in the wood. I think maybe here's a good place. Just do a circle like this. Just kind of make it defined a little bit. Again, this is really easy to do with uh, pastels. If I use something like colored pencil, I think it would take a really long time. But... And in the camera, you know, it's, you know, if you see it up close, maybe not look really um, realistic, but through the camera, especially for a, uh, a dimly lit movie like this one, horror movie, mystery movie, it's gonna look, it's gonna look really good. Okay, so here we go. You know that took how long? Three minutes or less? This paper I found is not quite the same color uh, as these walls, but it works. So first I'm gonna tear a piece. This is gonna be the, um, wallpaper that's sticking out. And I can take a color pencil. I just happen to have this on hand because we're kind of in a rush to finish the set. But um, there's also, you know, you can use uh, pastels too. Just to get some, some texture. And you can even do it on a rough surface like a carpet. So it has some uh, bumpiness. So again, this is kind of a rush, a rush kind of method, so let's just leave it at that. So I think I want the wallpaper to be sticking out here. Let's do it like that. And let's just bend it so it looks like it's sticking out. I think that looks pretty good. Looks like the wallpaper came to here and then the wallpaper got a hole in it, right? 